safe. Whip. Up. Up. <laughs> Not to be walked on. Even a deer wouldn't walk there, but you see there's some deer tracks. You can see where the deer came. There's a hole there, but I should be able to walk right over here quite safely. Oh, a little hollow. Hop. <laughs> We're all past there. I may be able to pass between the two holes. See, there's a hole right here, a hole right there, but I can probably pass right here, sure. That's the beauty of this pole, you don't have to guess. You know exactly where you're safe. I've been far for, uh, for filming when I crossed over the, uh, the bad ice. So we'll, uh, we'll do that again. I don't remember where I passed now. Oh, I guess right here, yeah. So, uh, I'm using my pole. I called it a while ago a sounding pole. I guess I should uh, call it a testing pole. I say sounding because you can tell by the sound of it, but also uh, you gotta. So right here, there's open water. Very. This is just a little bit of ice that formed maybe last night. It's very very thin. But you can zoom in a little bit just on where the where the bottom of my pole is. There, Garnet. So this here is uh, definitely not something to walk on. <laughs> However. When I go over here, then I can tell that that part is solid. So all I need to do is step from here to there, and, uh, and then I'll be good. What I want to make sure is that it's not thin over there, so I'm going to try and hold my pole way out and go at the right angles, but yeah, that's, that's hitting quite solid. So what I'll do, I use this to kind of support me a little bit. Oop, good. <laughs> somewhere there that's pretty good so that helps me to support a bit and I just step over the weak part and I'm now back on good firm ice so I was able to get past this uh, rotten part which is uh, something to avoid so I'll uh, I'll see if I can do the same thing over there Handy to have long legs. Okay. Uh, yeah, you see right here. I used my pole a while ago and found that that was all weak. But okay, here's open here. Oh, that's fairly solid. So I'll see if I can cross here between these two. Yeah. Oh, that's a bit weak there. That's good there. So then I just walk across there. Yeah, so that's good. Again, only when it's thin water. I mean, I know what I can't drown here. It's only uh, a couple of feet of water, less than a meter. So, uh, but it's just all skills that you can develop that you can use for a lifetime. This is all good. Sometimes right at the transition zone between that slush and here where the snow insulates and sometimes it won't it won't freeze as well. See right here, I'm sure I can punch through. Yeah, sure enough. It's good enough to hold me because it took quite a wallop to, to put it through. I can walk on that and feel quite confident. See, and yet I was able to, to go through with that, I won't walk there, and I won't walk there. Right here, I'll walk. You're quite safe. 
So you can be close to open water, just don't step in the open water. All right, cut.